another day, another week Fresh off work, time to get off my feet And gotta grab a little drink, a little something to eat Hit up all our friends and tell them let's meet Can we talk about this life? Let's enjoy ourselves Can we talk about this life? Make it all about us Today, choose to be happy every day, choose to be great in every way. Can we talk about this life? Let's enjoy ourselves. Can we talk about this life? Make it all about us. Can we talk about this life? You gotta enjoy this life today. Choose to be happy every day, choose to be great in every way. Sometimes this shit gets hard And we wanna give up this fight But it gets a little better He tries, it gets a little better We're not alone in this walk And we'll realize when we talk So can we get together? And can we talk? Can we talk about this life? Let's enjoy Can we talk about this life? Make it all about us Can we talk about this life? Enjoy this life today Choose to be happy every day Choose to be great in every way Can we talk about this life? You gotta enjoy this life today Choose to be happy every day Choose to be great in every way Can we talk? Hey there, I'm Ronnie. And I'm Kim. And we'll be performing with Denise Tishner and Friends for the Motown Special in Indianapolis, Indiana. On July 24th, 2022. At the Madam C.J. Walker Legacy, Legacy. Center. Yeah. <laughs> we want you all to be in the house because it's going to be a fantastic show. Get ready to come in and sing some of your favorite tunes with some of your favorite singers all again in Indianapolis, Indiana with Denise Tishner and Friends. July 24th, 2022. We'll see y'all there. And remember, ain't nothing like the real thing, baby. Ain't nothing like the real thing. Yo, good morning, Soul Vibers. So, as y'all seen recently, we just got finished doing some promo, some promo video footage and whatnot for uh, some upcoming stuff that I need to get done to be able to shop out and do all that kind of stuff. So, this next venture that we're on looks like um, looks like Indiana. Got to go to Indianapolis, Indiana to go and uh, be a part of Denise Tishner and Friends, a Motown special. Uh, Got to go do some old school stuff. So uh, I'll be headed out to go to Indiana, Indianapolis uh, in a little while. And it's really crazy because, well, as y'all can see right now, I'm kind of doing the dog thing. Rocky. Yeah, so that's him. But anyway, I'm sitting here walking my dog before I get ready to head out because I still got to go get a haircut. I still got to make a couple of stops before I even hit the road. And like I said, usually I fly, but this time I'm going to actually drive out because I have never had the opportunity to put my Porsche to the road like like to really put the pedal to the metal so i want to i want to take my take my porsche out on the road to do that so i'm going to drive there and uh i'm going to link up with some more friends when i get there and whatnot but um that's what we got going on uh so until i get ready to go get my hair cut i'm just going to kind of walk y'all through my day and uh hope y'all in you know enjoy the ride and we'll get at y'all in a minute all right all right yo what's up y'all so I need to get in the habit of uh, using some of the YouTube lingo. Y'all know I'm new to this. I don't really know what I'm doing, but y'all follow me anyway. But um, as you can see, I'm in my car. I'm actually headed to the barbershop uh, because I told you all before I'm getting ready to go to Indiana to go do a show, yada, yada, blah, blah, blah. So when you watched the last episode, you saw me doing like some promo video and you got some footage from that kind of stuff or whatever. And I know that a lot of you all didn't know how much like really goes into putting on a show and it's crazy 
because you would think that, especially when it comes to artists, that the only thing that we show up and do is sing. But nine times out of 10, when you have your independent artists, they're actually running everything, especially if you're an independent artist without management. And see, I, I'm taking on a new manager and a new management team and all this kind of stuff. So they're learning the ropes when it comes to how I like to do things. So with that being like my first show back since the pandemic, um, it, everything really basically fell on me. Like I had to show everybody, hey, this I want to do this venue. I had to do this, and then we ended up having some little complications with the venues and whatnot and all that kind of stuff. But saying all that to say, the best thing about being called and featured on somebody else's show, you ain't got to do none of that. So I get to go to Indiana and just basically I got my music. I already know everything I got to learn. I got my little dance steps, choreography. They sent me all that stuff. And all I got to do is just go and do what I really like to do. Just go and do the thing. Um, there is a little couple of little business things that I got to do. Um, as far as, you know, just the contracts and things of that nature. But as far as like looking up venues and calling this person, doing man, I ain't got to do none of that. And I'm really like, I'm always excited when I have to do the less amount of administrative work and I can like really focus more so on the creative aspect of things. So um, Indiana's gonna be a gonna be a really, 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 really dope time. Um, and as y'all know, or maybe you don't know, but um, I sing R&B, I sing country, I sing gospel, I, I, anything, anything that's gonna pay me green money, baby, I'm in that thing. So of course, I'm doing this uh, Motown special with uh, Denise Tishner and friends, but also on Sunday morning, I've been booked to go and do some uh, some praise and worship or whatever the case they may call for, you know, some artistry um, at a church on Sunday morning too. So again, that's why I got to head to the barbershop. I'm looking a little rough. I look like I stink, but I did get my hair braided. Um, I didn't go for the plaques. I just got them braided straight back into like a little ponytail or whatever. So I'm going to go on ahead to the chop shop so they can go on and get me right before I get ready to get this roll. Again, I still got to make a couple of stops. We'll see what that looks like if I'm going to bring y'all along with me. But probably the next time y'all see me, I'll probably be in the car. I'm, this is not the Porsche. I'm in my other car right now. Um, I'm in my runner. Y'all know I'm, I'm from the hood. We got, we got running around here, baby. But yeah, but I will get at y'all real soon. All right. Peace out. Yo, so I know I'm greasy, don't mind me, but whatever. Uh, longer story short, I'm uh, I'm still in Nashville, Tennessee at uh, 9.32 p.m. And uh, as a matter of fact, I'm at Sonic getting ready to give me something to eat because I'm just now leaving to hit the road to go to Indiana. Don't ask me why, we'll talk about that tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs>
I'm at the venue for tonight. Yes, baby mommy. Well, hold on. We're gonna we're gonna go grab my baby mommy. Y'all gonna have to meet her anyway because she'll be in a lot of my my stuff. So I want y'all to come on, come on, baby mommy. Come on. We gotta we gotta climb these stairs because we gotta sing tonight. So, y'all see this me and my baby mommy. That's Kim, that's Kim Flynn. No, I don't remember that song. That's a Negro scripture. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Never heard of it. <laughs> I think y'all I think I'm doing a good job at making sure I log all this stuff. Y'all look there go Kevin. That's Kevin Wells. He's been taking care of me this. This whole weekend. This is the weekend. This is the weekend. The weekend. Yes. To make sure that uh I'm where I'm supposed to be. When I'm supposed to be. I ain't nobody ain't trying to dog you nowhere. Y'all, this is here, little Steve Ang. <laughs> Y'all, she's crazy. So, again, that's Kim Fleming. That's my, my baby mommy, affectionately known as. But um, this is the venue for the evening. Let y'all kind of peek that out. We're in Indiana at the Madam C.J. Walker building. I'm not going out there to go show y'all the, the stage from out there. Hopefully, somebody will grab my phone and and try to get some because the cameraman, I, Ash is not with me this time, so I'm on my own. But again, that's the that's the stage um, for the Motown special tonight. And of course, again, there's the the audience. I actually am a uh, well, you'll see. I'm, I'll be actually opening up the show tonight with the first selection. But uh, that's all you're gonna get out of that. And hopefully, I really will make sure that um, I hook up with somebody so we get some footage to make sure y'all can at least get a little glimpse of something that goes down tonight. Um, so, so therefore, again, I am the, uh, I'm one of the, I'm one of the temptations. I'm one of the, uh, I'm about to say the five heartbeats. Definitely not one of the five heartbeats. One of the four tops as well as Sam Cooke. So, of course, everything today, I got to sing real high. And like I said, I've been singing at church all morning, but you know what? We good. We're going to knock this show out and, and get it going. And, uh, yeah, so I don't know. We'll see if we can grab y'all again in a minute to, to get a little something for y'all. So again, I'm Ronnie. I'll see y'all in a minute. Peace out. So, I never got a chance to show y'all where I stayed during this time uh, in Indiana, but as you can see, on the lake front, pond front, I guess, but this is the, the outside, the back part that kind of views it. Use that part. I'll take y'all to the house. Here we go. Oops. So here we go. First part. Let me come up into this area over here. Y'all can see the Airbnb. So we're giving it a head out. I wish I would have been able to show y'all while I was here. Got here and went right into work. They got a little move, little, little camera. Over here. So I actually ended up sleeping in a couple of times. Pretty dope. Yeah, I'm just like a little bit here. We're gonna have the So this is just the downstairs, we're not even upstairs. So then, make sure I'm going upstairs.
It is an upstairs in the lot. Then you come up here, and then you say, baby mommy. Okay, I hear you. So then, my baby mommy in there. Then you got another little area. Y'all see his beds everywhere. Okay, you good. Okay. And then yes, you see the master bedroom, pretty dope room. And it overlooks the uh, lake again. You can see that through there, the pond or whatever you want to call it. And I'm moving too fast. I know y'all can see it. It's a lot of stairs, and I got my backpack and everything on. And then, of course, more rooms, bathrooms, another room, blah, blah, blah. And then, there's one more room. Let's go up one more time. We get up here. It's just a sitting area, but it's pretty dope. Little dope sitting area. So, that's basically the house that uh, we stayed in, the whole past, whatever. Dope people, great time, great show. Um, so, I'm getting ready to head out with uh, Kim Funny. Y'all remember I called her baby mommy. Getting ready to head out, hit the road, uh, put the pedal back to the middle. It had only taken me about three hours to get to Indiana, apparently I went this way where nobody goes and it's like a new interstate thing. It's supposed to take us five hours to get here. We literally got here in three. So, gonna take that route back out. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll see y'all when I get back to the city. All right, peace out.